welcome back to some more cognition everybody so now we have both Erica and Cordelia under the same roof and we can switch between them so some kind of puzzle will require two of them to do some kind of thing That must have been really hard for her. Bugging out, babe. <laughs> Erica is bugging out. This must be Cordelia's father with someone important. They look happy. Daddy with Senator Aaron Light. We were happy. Okay, okay. Now that you did that, right? What she know that is Aaron Light? Erica, Erica. What are we looking for? Let's try the basement over there. He was here recently. Eh, eh, ah! That's creepy. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing that. <laughs> no. So but maybe I could use Cordelia's hand to search it. That is a bit. No, I'd burn my hand. Kane's lair. This is the first trap. The George siblings in the old factory. And this one. Joe and Cameron, when he started using tombs. Janelle and Robert, he planned it all here. Scott? He never lets them live. There's always a backup plan ever since me and Max. You're the only one who ever got away from him. Cordelia. What was done to you was unspeakable. More than probably anyone else, I understand. But what you've done is wrong. Don't pretend you know me just because you've seen my past. What Keith did was wrong. I am not like Keith. I did good, Erica. Someone had to stop Antony and Joey. I saved others. They will never kill again. I agree, honestly. I can't say that I condemn you for stopping them. But why Davies? Why Sully? They were doing their jobs. No, they weren't. They didn't listen. The night I took Joey, he was headed to Melissa's apartment. I tried to warn Sully, but he didn't listen. Melissa? If you hadn't sent your warning as a cryptic message, he would have done something about it. I know Sully. But what did you want me to do? Tell him I could see the future? I already tried that, remember? Didn't go too well. You're still wrong, Cordelia. You're pretending that this is all about poetic justice, but deep inside, this is just an excuse to get your revenge. That's why you want McAdams. All right. Janelle's trap. Scotty, I wish I could have found this then. So this is the one that killed Hopwell. He killed Joe Hollowell in one of these. There's something different about it. This looks familiar. Seen it before? I have, but not put together like this. He knows about us, doesn't he? Of course, and he must be experimenting on us right now. 
How long would a pair of scions take to solve this puzzle? I can almost hear him. You didn't even plan all of it, did you? It was him. He helped me put it together. He gave me ideas. He played you, that's what he did. No, I was in control. Where is he then? You were supposed to kill him. <sighs> what a stupid plan. This was the one for the George siblings. They held each other's hands as they were killed. What is this? Another one of his games. And how do we solve this one? If I knew the answer, I would have already solved it. Cordelia? Huh? Really frustrating. Give up. night. Erica, the stuff you're saying. Keep it up. I think I'm getting something related to it through my power that will help us open this thing. <sighs> no dice. This was installed recently, and he didn't even try to solve it once. Looks like- <gasps> Open, damn it! I give up. I don't know how to open this! Give up. Erica. The stuff you're saying. I, I understand. Keep it up. I think I'm getting something related to it through my power that will help us open this thing. Erica, the stuff you're saying. Keep it up. I think I'm getting something related to it through my power that will help us open this thing. <sighs> open, damn it! I give up. You catch it? night. Erica, the stuff you're saying. Keep it up. I think I'm getting something related to it through my power that will help us open this thing. Great. Come on, I don't have all night. Erica, the stuff you're saying. Keep it up. I think I'm getting something related to it through my power that will help us open this thing. <sighs> this is impossible. There's no way I can do this without help. Oh, this is getting really frustrating. Cordelia? Erica, the stuff you're saying. Keep it up. I think I'm getting something related to it through my power that will help us open this thing.
Look at all this stuff. Nails and hair. I didn't know he was this disturbed, at least not back when he was out killing freely. This isn't uncommon for serial killers. Wait, what's this? My high school graduation ring? What is this doing? Oh, Scotty's bracelet. I wondered where this had gone. He took a lot from both, from a lot of people. Did you know, da did you know Davy's family? What do you care? You murdered her. Another one of Kane's games. I did the ring. What are we supposed to do with these? If I know Keith, it's some sort of combination.
Yes, I did it all by myself. I feel proud. I was almost tempted to use the house. So let me show you what went. So if you remember, we cocked with Erica and Cordelia and showed us something for 1998, 2018, right? But there's nothing for 2011. So I said to myself, okay, we have the past, the future, and so we So I said, okay, what if there is something coincided with the past and the future? So I said, let me see where the arrow, the, the arrows are pointing for all of them and what they all have in common. And it turned out to be one, two, three. I'm getting tired of this game. What are you going to do when we find Keith? He's going to answer for what he's done. What do you want it to be, Cordelia? I don't know. What matters to me is that he understands that I'm doing this for him too. Maybe to make up for what he's done to all those people. For what he did to you and your brother. Maybe I should have come right to you, Erica, instead of trying to connect from a distance. What about what you've done? This one doesn't... That's how the stuff position in the room is the answer. He used all of the figurines in each pin. He's just trying to confuse you. He knew you'd try it. This is where the group for this trap goes. I'll leave the sta- This one doesn't-
This is where the group for this trap goes. This is where the group for this trap goes. This is where the group for this trap goes. I'll leave this. Those two. This is where the group for this trap goes. He used all of the he's just
Still oh. sure you were the one in control? in a place only Cordelia would know. Anything? He talked to me. He says the next one is Max's, and that only you would know where it is. Damn you, Keith. Can you give me one thing straight? Let's look around to see if my memory triggers. Do you have any ideas, Cordelia? Let me look around. I'm sure that could trigger some memories. Max would spend hours there. Maybe this is what Keith meant. This was Max's favorite place in the house. Now we need to put out the fire to search through it. I don't want to go in there. It brings... This could come in handy. Any wounds I'm likely to get... Nothing like stuck. This could come in handy. Any wound. This could. 
This should help. Now let's look. I found Max, I think. You can keep it. I thought you liked his games. I never did. That was the problem. That wasn't so bad. That was a fairly easy puzzle. Think, Eric. This is not going... It won't come out. Think, Eric. It's badly burned. There's something written on it, but it's way too small for me to read. It says, find a light in the darkness. Any ideas? No, but I can look around and see if I remember anything. Those two don't work together. Those two don't work together. Max would spend hours there. Maybe this is what Keith meant. This was Max's favorite place in the house. 
Now we need to put out the fire to search through it. Max would spend hours there. Maybe this is what Keith meant. This was Max's favorite place in the house. Now we need to put out the fire to search through it. I need a better reason to do that. I need a better... That's Daddy. Things would be so different if he was still around. He's with Senator Aaron Light. Good man. She had a niece. Davies did. She loved her to pieces. When she was around, you could almost see Davies smile. Maybe she wasn't perfect, but she didn't deserve what you did to her. Even if she didn't help you when she could have, even if you went to prison, maybe she didn't deserve her rank, but everyone deserves to live. Daddy would have said that. He liked people that did good. He said the senator's last name was not a coincidence. Wait, Aaron Light. A light. Look for a light. Keith, you tricky little... Erica, look at this. Did he hide it there? Only one way to find out. See, as we think, and be, as we hear, as we hear sometimes. Here, let me take a look. Ugh. I'd be very eager to kill him if I were you. My job is justice, not revenge. I'm not like you. We'll see. When the two of you are face to face. Hey, after I tell him, those are some good figurines. Kane's figurine of me. Fucking creepy. I apologize if you hear music in the background. I have a neighbor that's playing his music very loudly. There's one missing. This must be who we're looking for. Knowing Keith, we're not going to find it easily. We'll need to figure this one out. No, but I know where they are now. I just saw it. Shit, they must have followed me. Not so fast. You need to get me out of here. I can leave through the back, but you have to help me. Oh, shit. Go! You'll need this. Bring McAdams to Mount Auburn Cemetery. Where Scott died? We'll save your dad. He's one of the good guys.
got some. Some good ass graphic. Hey, this is the last episode, you know. What were you doing back there? That doesn't matter. You have to listen to me. If you are not going to answer my questions, save it for your attorney, Reed. McAdams. What? We're still on the back roads. The highway is another few miles away. If I'm gonna get out of here or convince him to let me go, I need to do it before then. McAdams. What? <sighs> yeah, right. He's not gonna listen to a word I have to say as long as he's in control of this situation. I need to get out of these cuffs and into that driver's seat. Somehow. Can we stop for a minute? I'm getting car sick. I wasn't born yesterday, Reed. Suck it up. Jerk. I also wasn't born deaf. Or blind. <laughs> really? Not with the window closed. I've really done it this time. How the hell am I gonna get out of this? How am I gonna get him to come with me, willing to know? Ugh. McAdams locked the windows. Only he can roll it down. Not with the wind. I'm not sure, honestly. Window, window, radio. Not with the McAdams. What? Mind rolling the window down? Your cologne's killing me here. Fine. Okay. What are you doing? Trying to stretch. You might not know this, but sitting in a car in cuffs, not very comfortable. Hmm. Huh. I need some noise in here. That could help distract McAdams. If only I could get it turned on. Can I connect my phone to the radio? No. McAdams. What? Fine, you win the quiet game. Turn on the radio at least. Your comfort is not my concern at this point. Why don't we talk about what you did to Cordelia Smith then? You want to discuss that? Because I could spend the whole ride talking about it. Fine. Radio it is. Was that? I do not need this right now. Please, what, what are you? Stop! Believe it or not, I really am sorry, but I don't have time for this. Are you fucking insane, Reed? Let me out of these cuffs now! I can't do that, McAdams. Kane is out there, and if I don't bring you to her, he's going to kill my father. What the hell are you talking about? McAdams, I... Save it. I have no interest in anything you have to say at this point, Reed. You attacked a federal agent, and now you handcuff your supervisor? 
How the fuck do you think this is going to end? I didn't want it to go down like this, McAdams. If you'd just trusted me, if you'd ever trust anyone, we wouldn't even be in this situation. That's what your problem is. What are you talking about? You haven't trusted me since Scott was kidnapped, if ever. But if you'd actually given Cordelia Smith a chance, a lot of people might still be alive today. Reed, goddammit! Anyone that pulls half the shit you've pulled over these years would have been fired on the spot. You still had your job because Davies and I knew you were a good agent. My job requires me to do things by the book. You don't like the book. I get that. But what I've done, I've done to protect you. And your life will be much easier the minute that you understand that I'm not your enemy. What do you know about Cordelia Smith? I know the truth. I know what you did. Ignored her, arrested her, the cover-up, all of it. You refuse to stop living in the past, Reed. Mistakes happen. They may be tragic, but there's no going back. You're right. There's no changing the past or bringing back the people you've lost or wronged. The best anyone can do is learn from it. If it happened again today, I'd do things differently. I'm sorry for what happened to that woman, but there's nothing I can do about it now. For your own sake, you have to stop making it personal, Erica. You made it personal with Jetta. You did your best to protect her, and I appreciate that. But understand that if I had made it personal, I would never have put her in such risk. I couldn't let my feelings for her get in the way. You couldn't understand. You don't have a family, Sam. And that's probably the reason why, Erica. Look, I'm just asking you to listen. I'm not crazy. Kane is back out there, and he will kill my father if I don't hurry. And what makes you so certain of any of that? The man's been a ghost for three years now. Are you sure this isn't your feelings clouding your judgment once again? I know because Cordelia Smith is the one behind every killing, and the Kane killer is her brother Keith Smith, aka Jeff Therian. How can I believe you given the way you've been acting? You shot John! That was an accident. You're FBI. Your job doesn't allow for accidents. Fine. You're gonna have to explain that one to me. You found this information at the towers? Yes, there's more. I'd rather do this with your help, McAdams, but I'm doing it either way. Keith Smith has been missing and presumed dead for six years. What a better way to get away with murder. He forced Cordelia to kill Max after learning he wasn't their biological brother. She took the blame, and he was free to disappear and keep killing. Think about it, McAdams. He fits the profile. Caucasian male, 25 to 45, highly intelligent, obsessed with his work, plenty of reasons to be hung up on close sibling relationships. Shit! Then where the hell has he been for the last three years? Chained up in the basement of the Enthon Towers. What? So what's it gonna be? Fine. If it'll bring them in and save your father, you've got my help. I have to warn you. Cordelia wants you dead. I can take care of myself. How do you know where the hell you're heading? Cordelia told me. You just told me this woman is a murderer. And she's also a victim of your negligence. Are you justifying her, Reed? No, McAdams. I know what my job is. I'm just saying that sometimes things aren't as black and white as I wish they were. Not even in that book of yours. You came. I told you I'd help. You brought him. What do you want with him? That is between him and me. Don't we have something better to do than chat about this? You're right. Let's go. We're wasting time.
so we're working with a killer now, Reed. Is that your big plan? Listen, she brought me here. I feel I can trust her intentions. He's down there. If we want to save your father, we'll have to play his game. We'll have to let him capture us. Otherwise, the outcome... I can't see it ending well. How is that a good plan at all? We'll have a chance. I see these sorts of things, remember? You have to trust me. Get me the fuck out of here! You'll betray me! You've seen that one too? I told you, the future is a fickle thing. I do want to help you, Erica, but I am who I am. I make no promises about what happens down there. The same. I can't promise what I'll do after my father is safe. Are you ready? Will you keep my father safe? I'll handle Kane. You're too invested in this, Erica. I'll do my job, McAdams. But I know Kane better than you do. Fine. But I'll be there if you screw up. Dad! He's alive, still. Why do you have to bring a full party? It makes things more... difficult. Let him go, you bastard! Didn't you get enough with Scott? No. I've been waiting too long to finish this. And it has to be done right. Cordelia, would you tie Erica to this? And if you try anything, I will shoot someone! And that might be you. Apologies, Agent. <laughs> what? Don't all three of them have guns? Make sure those are tight. Coming up. Did you take now. a weapon? Yes. No? All right. And his? You don't need to worry about him. He's my problem. Then take care of him. Stand over there where I can see you both. You wanted to copy me eventually, Cordelia. Isn't that right? Kill me? The same I kill? I never wanted to kill you, Keith. No. You just made me wish I was dead. The Cordelia I loved, she would never be so cruel. You changed everything when you made me kill Max. And we're here now and can't even talk the way we used to. That connection only you and I had. I don't want you dead, but for this to stop, you have to die. It's a mystery to me what goes on in your beautiful brain sometimes. But I have a theory. What will you do after I'm dead? I never mourned over Max's death, but... But you do have a conscience, Cordelia. And you've been suppressing it so you could act freely. But when it wakes up, when moms and dads and Max's memory awaken you, there won't be a swift death that will allow your brain to cope with what you've done to get here. Your domino effect failed, just as I knew it would. Agent Reed never killed me. And so, who will kill me now, sister? It won't be you. We both know that your conscience wouldn't let you. Exactly my thoughts. And Erica Reed, I've learned so much about you over the years. Now we finally get to be properly introduced. I'm curious to know how much pain you can endure. As I push this lever, this spike, will move towards you. If you scream, if you do so much as whisper, I will press this at full speed in the other direction, over to your father. It will kill him instantly. What do you get from all this? It's a subject that's always interested me, these human connections of love and family, because the only time I felt a connection to her, she preferred someone else. So, shall we begin the experiment? That's it for tonight, you can blame her for it. 
So we'll see you the next time for the conclusion of Punk Machine. Thanks for watching, everyone.